don't know what it is, it's the mob today I have from Unbox Industries, Rick from Splatterhouse. This is a glow in the dark edition. I pretty much reviewed all the figures in the line except for the Biggie Man. If you go back and watch my old videos, they're pretty much trash compared to what I do now. And that's what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to elevate and not do everything the same. Everyone does the same thing where you can see the hands and they're doing the review or they're in a booth. I'm just trying to avoid that now. Maybe I'll incorporate it here now then because it's necessary. You have to mess with articulation and whatnot. I got a new mic as well. And what I'm going to do is edit the video and watch the video and do the commentary, what I'm currently doing right now. To get back to the figure, it's sculpted by Retroband. It's a classic sculpt. I just love this figure. No slight to Zectron or Retroband, but I wish they would do more sculpts with the original sculptor like they did with Hal Chaos, that would be amazing. They need to do another dead man. That's my constant gripe. You know, people just have a vision in their mind how the figures are supposed to look and that's just what I have in my heart and it's, the scope that they had was just not it. If I have any gripes at all, it's the way that they painted the bottom of the pants. You could see by the shoulders and the arms, they painted it perfect, but for whatever reason they didn't paint it perfect by the pants. It, kind of bother it does bother me it does and here's a shot of the glow in the dark i was outside during the day doing the shots i bring it inside the house and in broad daylight it was still shining even in a little bit of dim light and outside it's just very bright i wanted to just show a little bit of contrast with some light and in the dark it's pretty nice here they are side by side with the new splatterhouse 2 rick I can't say which one I like better, I like both of them, but this is Glow in the Dark Edition Rick from Splatterhouse, from Unbox Industries, it's the mob.